Hello folks and welcome here once again to Divine Fine Motors and thank you so so very much for being here. God bless you and your family and I mean that. And folks I want to congratulate you on finding this one. This you probably know is a very very rare truck. These are a limited edition run back in 2008. This They only made 5,000 of these. And this is number 3500, which is uh, on a badge inside these trucks. And as you can see, this is a 3500 of 5000. I like that 3500, nice rounded number. But folks, you're looking at one of the nicest 2008 Ford Crew Cab, big V8, all wheel drive, four wheel drive trucks that I have ever found. I think this is the first one of these that I've ever had the privilege to sell anyone. And I'm going to share this with you right now. This is the nicest one. Inside, outside, this thing is absolutely just gorgeous. Has the big old nice 22 inch factory wheels that are just in excellent, excellent condition. Has the nice limited, of course, all the way around it. This is only a two-owner truck, elderly man, and I think it was the same owner. Uh, it, he's a snowbird guy. He had it down here. He had it up in Pennsylvania for a while. But, boy, you can tell he has just loved on it, man. You can still feel the love and see the love. All of the uh, door jams, all of your... Uh, gaskets around the doors, the hinges, everything. There is totally this body underneath it looks great. No rust in the corners of anywhere. It all is just in excellent, excellent condition. And these things, like I said, this is one of the best looking trucks I think that Ford ever made. I like their Harley Davidson editions too, but man, this pearl on this truck is just gorgeous. I don't see anywhere at all where it's ever been painted. It says it's had an accident, but I could not tell you where that occurred at. It may be that he might have ran into somebody at a stoplight. Somebody might have ran into the back bumper. I don't know. That looks like that's the original Ford thing on there. It's a little faded, but uh, this thing is just, again, in pristine excellent excellent condition it's just had an oil change it's got some super nice 22 inch all season radial tires on it it's of course the big 5.4 trinitron v8 all wheel drive it's got the rain guards on it you got the factory running boards on it again it is just in excellent excellent condition the top of it, the bed, it's got a nice cover on it. It's got a bed liner on it. Again, these beautiful, beautiful Ford factory uh, limited wheels are just awesome. Uh, the paint, man, this truck is just, it just looks and shines like it did new. Again, it's number 3,500. He had mats over his limited mats. And then you got some nice WeatherTech floor mats that go up front. He's got the tow package on it. The spare tire underneath has never been on the ground. And it's in not bad condition under there. I'm not one to take a bunch of black paint and start painting stuff underneath there. It's been up north. I'm from West Virginia, but that surface rust on that metal down there is no, is no problem at all. Underneath, you can see the bed. You can see how nice it is. Uh, all these corners. He's got his nice white grease inside all that stuff. This man was 74 years old. He is a veteran. He's got his veteran sticker up there. And uh, what's that say? He's a proud member of the American Legion. Service to God and country. Praise God about all that. I'm with you, brother. But anyway, you can tell this old fella has taken just excellent, excellent care of his vehicle. Like I said, these are getting harder and harder to find. And this one is just awesome. 
the back seats looks like he never used them and never had anybody sitting back here all the jack and everything still right there just like it was new the carpet is just immaculate like the rest of it all the leather the seats the headliner of course it comes with the sunroof I mean it's just awesome it's got all the keys both the keys both the key fobs all the owners manuals I mean you just it's just listen I've been doing this 32 years guys and girls it's hard to find these trucks period but to find one in this kind of condition it, it's uh this is a divine find that's praise God that's why I call my business divine find but uh, you won't find a nicer, cleaner one than this. And it's only got 97,000 miles on it. That's a very rare thing, too. Of course, like I said, he was a retired fella, older fella. And most of those miles was getting out of that old coal and snow and coming down here in Florida for the winter. Smart man. I left West Virginia about 25 years ago, me and my wife. Praise God, it was a, had a big snowstorm late like a March snowstorm. All the power went out and everything, and I said, honey, let's get out of here and head south, and we've been down here ever since for 25 years. Again, you can see all the door jams, everything. Folks, listen, I am a such a meticulous person, and when I go out and look for you a vehicle, I want it to be as if I was buying it myself, and I'm telling you what, this is one of the nicest ones of these you will ever have a chance to purchase. And if I was you, I would hold on to it as long as I could because it will only go up in value as time goes on. Right now, trucks are one of the most fastest growing segments of the car collecting bunch out there. But you can see what you've got here. I mean, it's as good, it's as, good as you're going to get. A big crew cab four-wheel drive and there's not many of these left out there I wouldn't think and very very few of them in this kind of excellent condition all this wood grain just looks fantastic the leather seats I mean look this is the driver seat and the passenger seat and the rear seats hardly look set in but one thing I'll tell you about Ford's and I'm a big General Motors person too but Ford's have the best leather seats the best seats period they're so very comfortable. They're nice and wide. They're just in excellent, excellent condition. And uh, they are super, super nice. As I said, you're going to get both the keys, both the key fobs, uh, sunroof. I mean, this thing is just, the headliner looks like they haven't even touched it up there. The vanity mirrors. You got the... Uh, Owner's manuals right there, six disc CD changer, the MP3 hookup, hook up your phone. Uh, it's got it all. I don't think it's ever had a cigarette smoked in it, and I don't believe, praise God, it's ever had a french fry eaten in it. It's just really super, super nice. I know I'm a car salesman, and I know what you've heard about car salesmen, believe you me. But I'll tell you what, I'm a straight shooter, and I'm just going to tell you the facts. And like I said, I'm very, very exclusive. If I go out and buy something, praise God, it's going to be good. You can see there they just changed it all not too long ago. Look at the driver's carpet. I mean, boy, you know, I wish everybody would take care of their vehicles like this guy did. Again, it's only got about 27,000, or 97, 27. 97,325 miles. It might have a few more miles by the end of the auction, but not very many. And uh, I can help you get it shipped anywhere in the country. I can help you get it shipped out of the country. But uh, again, you need to get on the phone and give me a call because this baby won't last. Sometimes every now and then I run into those Lincoln trucks and uh, crew cabs and uh, the last one I had of those it was a 2006 it had about a hundred and fifty thousand miles on it and but they're still worth a fortune I mean I had to pay a fortune for it and the guy you know he didn't they're not cheap but this one here it's not going to cost you 16 or 17 or 18 thousand uh, dollars I'm going to have the reserve on this thing under 15 thousand and again with only 97 thousand miles on it folks it, it's nice. 
I mean, it is. You can see all the latches and stuff don't have no rust on them. Uh, it's just a really, really nice truck. You're going to love it. This, this pearl paint is just beautiful. I was telling my wife last night when we pulled into the driveway, I was looking at it. I said, man, I just love the color on that truck okay so there you go folks again thank you so much for being here i want to shout out real quick to all of my previous customers over the years you know we've been at this 10 years as i said i've been goodness almost 33 years in this business but thank all you all who have bought from carol and i and the kids over the last 10 years god bless each and every one of you we thank you we are so blessed to have you and I want to continue to go out and be a blessing to you. You know, I really, I pray at night for great, great vehicles, for great, great people. And uh, it does my heart good when I sell something like this to somebody because, man, you just, it's hard to find them. And you don't have to go through all that nonsense that you go through in those old dealerships. That's why I left the BMW dealership about 10 years ago. I just got tired of... Uh, all the nonsense back and forth. But anyway, I'm very, very fair-minded. I don't have a bunch of salespeople and managers and a big overhead and all that. I've got a nice big warehouse. You wouldn't even know I had a dealership if you drove by my place. I keep everything inside. I do have, of course, a sign on the door. But uh, I'm very, very exclusive. I sell everything I buy really, really quick. So again, if you want it, give me a call. If you haven't bought from us yet, well, congratulations and welcome to the family. And I've got people that call me all the time looking for different vehicles for either their self or their friends or their neighbors, and you'll be one of them as well. So anyway, congratulations. I'm going to get off of here. This is our home. We've lived here now going on about 15 years in this house. As I said, we've been in Florida about 25 years. My wife, Carol, and I are from West Virginia. Go West Virginia Mountaineers. We sent two of our hardworking kids up to the University of Florida and we sent one of them up to New Haven, Connecticut. Praise God she got into Yale University. Ain't that something? Praise God on that. But uh, she just graduated and now is teaching school. And that's another thing we do every time we sell a vehicle. We donate each month to a needy school and needy children. So you all might want to pitch in and do that as well. But if you buy from here you're doing that helping us do that. So thank you for that. Hey, listen, God bless you. Love on one another. Be kind to each other. Lift one another up when you can. And uh, please read to your children. Pour that love in them. Give them confidence in yourself. Make them feel real good about who they are. They're very special. And send them out into the world to just sow love and goodness. Okay, I got to get off of here. Give me a call and get this truck before it's gone. Bye-bye.